Hey loves! So today I'm going to be doing a luxury haul for you guys. I'm so excited to share this haul with you guys and um, get into a business and show you guys all the cute stuff that I got. Um, I'm going to first definitely show you guys the Prada bag because I am going to be using it today. So I didn't want to like, you know, put it back in the bag, fix the whole process kind of thing. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the bag so you guys see it ahead of time. Um, but other than that, stay tuned! Okay, so here is the Prada, like, actual bag. Not the bag, but the bag of the Prada bag. And here is the box. Here is the bag. Looks like this. I will be doing a separate review on this, by the way. And it's like a little crossbody. I love it for with just, like fun everyday outfits. I love it. It's so cute. Okay, so the next thing, I'm just going to show you guys all the stuff I got at Prada. Next thing I got here is a visor. It's the visor. I need to... I need to make some adjustments to this visor because it's just been in the box for too long but it's really cute and this I think retails at 210 if I'm not wrong cute I also picked up this really cute Prada wallet um, which I've just been, you know, wanting a cute card holder. I love small, cute card holders. I will also try to throw this into my review when I review the bag. Um, and I just absolutely love it. It's super cute and super chic. Um, and I bought this so I could, you know, put it in my bag as a cute little, like, card holder. It actually fits quite a bit. I was really shocked. So I'll definitely try to um, add this in my Prada bag review. I'm going to be sharing um, the rest of the stuff that I got and showing you guys um, all the cute things that I picked up other than all the Prada stuff that I showed you earlier. Um, so let's get right into it. Fendi socks that I got. Um, I've been wanting a pair of Fendi socks forever and I really wanted to get like tights or something but instead I ended up getting socks because I feel like I would get more wear out of them. Um, so these are the socks and I got these from Saks Fifth Avenue. Bags. And then they sent me a $100 wine voucher, um, which I need after spending $100 plus on a pair of socks. I definitely need a cup of wine to um, forget about everything. I'm St. Laurent. i um, super excited to show you guys this because I absolutely love card holders and card cases. If you guys have probably seen in my previous videos, I'm always buying card holders and card cases. So I went and I bought this one. It is so freaking cute. Um, absolutely love it. Sorry. It's like a very nice gray color and it's super, super cute. Um, I actually got this at a really good price because um, I had like reward points or like notes or whatever for a Nordstrom and um, I had pretty much collected quite a bit and I like was not understanding what I need to buy and they were going to expire. Whatever whole spiel, I basically ended up getting this for a hundred bucks. So next thing. I wanted this pair. I've been eyeing it for quite some time, so it was time. They're so cute. They're my little leprechaun shoes. And March 17th is coming up, so I'm gonna dress like a little leprechaun. Already decorated on my shelf. Um, but this is just so freaking adorable. Um, show you guys. It's so cute. Um, you can wear it like just you know like holding it like that or or you can also you know make it a little crossbody bag I'm not gonna hook the whole thing on but I'm just gonna show you guys if it was a crossbody you could wear it like that so it's super cute um, just to kind of throw everything in there 
So really quickly before the end of the video, I just want to say that I am extremely thankful to be able to, you know, buy all these amazing things for myself and um, be able to spend this type of money. Um, and I know there are some people that are not able to. And again, I'm not trying to make this video to make anyone feel bad or anything. You know, I want this to be a video for those who want to watch it or we just think it's like a cool video to watch. Um, I'm not trying to rub anything in anyone's face and I just want to throw it out there that, you know, if these are things that you wish you had or anything like that, you know, all I can tell you is just keep working hard and push through whatever you're going through and one day you will get to the level that you're able to buy whatever you want to buy. Um, I'm not going to get too much into depth or details on what my past life was or like my past story is or anything like that. But I can give like a really quick, you know, overview of how I grew up in a, again, joint family because I could not, we could not afford to, you know, stay anywhere else. We couldn't afford even an apartment. Um, I got to times where, you know, basically I was going to have to be given to orphanage because uh, my parents couldn't afford to keep me. So, you know. All that stuff is a little back story, but it's just like we worked through that and, you know, we never sat there and wished bad upon other people or we never thought of like, oh, like if they have that, why don't I have that? Because the more you covet other people and the more you always are worried about what other people are doing and why other people are doing that and why people have that and if they have that Chanel bag, why don't I have the Chanel bag? You're never going to get anywhere in life, you know, and I think if, you know, I think the way you got to see things is like, okay, if she has that Chanel bag, I'm going to work hard and get one too. You should never put anyone else down because they have more than you. You should never, you know, covet anything that anyone else has. I These are just all virtues and things that I grew up by and what I was taught um, you know, there would be new toys and stuff that would always be launching and I kid you not my mom was the type who would Make random toys at home. Like I remember, you know having to shove a old water bottle in a sock and make some type of toy out of that and You know again like everyone has their times in life and not everything always goes as smooth as you want it to but the only thing I can say is just be happy for everyone and just you know see this as just something to enjoy see this as something you know to oh like oh that product is sold in stores wow i didn't even know that i love those i want i want those i'm gonna work hard to get those you know just be happy for other people and let go and let god that's all i gotta say just you know don't think that i made this video to put anyone down or anything and again like i i don't know why i'm doing this whole spiel but I'm really just doing it because I don't want anybody to feel bad about this video or anything. I just want everyone to take something positive away from this and just be happy. Like, don't let anything else get in your way.